Hey what's up guys, Sebastian here from GreenMusicProductions.com. Today I'm here with another great product by Boom Library and this one is called Modern UI and it's a sound effects library and it's a dream come true for anybody who works in audio post productions. For those who don't know, I'm the head of the mixing department at Gameloft, so we do sound design and mix of all of their trailers, so it includes franchises like Modern Combat, Asphalt, uh, Nova, so I really really like that kind of stuff because I have to use and design a lot of modern UI stuff so it comes with over 7 gigabytes of sounds and it also includes all the metadata and the description file if you need to find a specific type of sound you can find it really fast there and um, it's categorized in families of sound like background, confirm, deny, hover, impact sweetener, pop-up, progress, scan, select, text, warning, whoosh and window. So there's a lot of stuff there and um, what's really nice about this library is that it doesn't repeat itself too much. It's really diversified in the tones and the different type of sounds. So I really like that. They didn't use a lot of recordings, they mainly use synthesis. So some are in your face and really clean, some are low profile. So let's listen to a couple of background sounds. Now there are uh, two different types of sounds, they're high and low ones. Uh, the low ones are more like a room tone ambient stuff a really nice I use that a lot and the high one are technological uh, sound let's listen to data hum these are nice long and they loop so uh, that's really useful uh, let's listen to another high one this is really good I really like that now the low ones are interesting um, there are tones that you can use kind of like uh, Let's say you're in an alien spaceship or in a big server, uh, you could use uh, those sounds as a background sound. They sound really good, by the way. Uh, confirm sounds, let's listen to a couple. Uh, they have small ones, medium and large ones. As you can see, there's a lot of sounds in there. And what's nice is every single wave file has multiple sounds that sound similar but are not exactly the same, so you don't have to use the same SFX over and over. So let's listen to liquid metal. Really nice. I really like that. It almost sounds like R2D2. You could use that for uh, robot sound design if you want to. Um, spectral grainy. This is really nice, really good stuff. Let's go listen to some medium. Classic. Nice. As you can see, these are pretty well designed so far. If you want, you can always layer them so you can create even more out of them. Um, so that's really cool. Let's go into large ones now. Alien hologram. Wow. <laughs> this is so cool. Uh, now the deny sounds, these are hard to sound design because usually they sound harsh and bad because you need to leave a negative impact on the viewer or the user. Um, but Boom Library are known for making extremely good sounding SFX. So let's listen to a couple of them. There are simple sounds, but there are also really complex sounds. So if you need something really simple, you can find what you need. And if you need a complex sound with many layers uh, that evolves, you can also find that kind of stuff. So let's listen to a medium one. Whoa. Like this one is complex. There's a lot of stuff happening there, but it sounds really good. The other sounds are a bit more quiet, but they're really nice. I really like that. Um, impact sweetener, uh, let's say uh, you're working on uh, an explosion with technological stuff in it. Uh, sometimes you will try some grenade sounds or explosion sound, but it's not enough. You need a bit of a sweetener or something that sounds a bit more technological. So this is really good for that. Yeah, these are really good too. Uh, Pop-up sounds. I really like that. I really like how diversified those sounds are. Now progress, this is something that is painful to design too because it needs to loop. 
and it needs to uh, not be too annoying. Uh, let's say you're designing a sound for an XP bar, energy bar that's refilling or just uh, computer progress stuff on TV shows like CSI New York. You always see those things, you know, like a, a pop up on your computer with a progress bar. So these are really good for that. really nice um, now scan sounds there's a lot of scan sounds uh, I really like those uh, you can use them for many things not only uh, scanning stuff but also like uh, layer texture or any uh, kind of technological texture really cool let's go into these small ones these are interesting I can really see in my head a scanner uh, when I hear those sounds, so this is a good sign. Uh, let's go into select sounds. Really cool stuff. Um, now we have text sounds. Um, this is really hard to design too. When it's not a mechanical keyboard that's typing, but it's something that appears on the screen and you see text appearing, this is quite hard to design. So I really like that kind of stuff. Let's listen to a couple. Really nice um, warning sounds. So these must be like alarm kind of stuff. Yeah. I like that. Uh, the whoosh, I use a lot of the cinematic trailer whooshes that they have. Uh, so if you like whooshes, you should check their cinematic trailers. I think they have two packs now. They're really good. Uh, I'll leave a link to their website in the description if you like that product and you want to see what else they're doing. Uh, these are the best in uh, sound effects libraries, in my opinion, uh, boom library. They're really, really good. So uh, let's listen to those whooshes. That's really cool. So let's say there's a spaceship passing by. You could use that. You could layer them if you want. And really cool stuff. Window sounds. Wow. These are really good sounding as you can see and there's a lot of stuff there. I just covered a small portion, but as I said, it's over seven gigabytes of sound. So um, as I said, check their website in the description if you like that. And if you like the video, click that like button and subscribe and see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.